this electric knife as a gift, right? It comes in this beautiful gift box. Here's what you get. The two different blades. I was just playing with a fork. That comes with it as well, that beautiful long carving fork. Let me flick it around and give, it, give you a proper look at it. And then, of course, you get the body of the knife, the charger. Now, the two different blades, this is the carving blade. This is the bread blade. And I'll show you the difference. Okay, that imagine that under the Christmas tree this year, you guys. I know, I know lots of people that would love to receive that. Okay, I've roasted a turkey, right? We're all going to be doing this for Thanksgiving. Have a look at how strong I've made this carving fork because I literally can go into there, right, that's, and I can lift that whole turkey up just like that and you can see it doesn't bend, it doesn't, it doesn't sort of strain. This is my gorgeous big carving board with that beautiful big station. All right, let's get down to business. Here it is, cordless. You know what that means? You're not going to cut through the cord, which, of course, is quite a dangerous thing. So I would never use one that does have the cord, to be perfectly honest. If I want to go through that leg, I can absolutely go straight on through that drumstick just like that. So you can go straight through bone with this knife. And then, of course, when it comes to doing the carving, you can do these beautiful, delicate slices. So I'm doing that on the breast. It just makes it, I'm not tearing away at it. I'm not, you know, and because of having no cord, I can use this in the dining room. I can use this, of course, in the kitchen. I can even take it outside by the grill during the summer months. But I tell you what, show up at the holidays, wherever you're going, with one of these knives, and you will be the most popular guest by far. Even offer to go ahead and carve that turkey. You can just see. I mean, look at how it literally goes straight through bone, right? So it is very robust when you need it to be. And, of course, when you want to do the little carving jobs on the breast, you absolutely can, just like that. So gorgeous, so, so simple and easy to use. And for the very first time ever, we've given it to you in that beautiful gift box. Now, it's not just for gifts. If you are um, keeping this for yourself, the other thing I love about it is this keeps everything together, all the pieces. You're never looking for a, a charger. You're never looking for your fork. Well, I am because I just picked it up quickly and it fell on the ground and Matt's going to give it to me any second now. Thank you, Matt. <laughs> Matt! <laughs> Thank you. I'll do it myself. Here we are. We've got the fork. We have the blade. That's the carving blade. That is the bread blade. And then, of course, you have the knife. The charger comes with it. You go ahead and you put it away until the next time you want to use it, and away you go. Now, I've switched it out. Very easy to do, by the way. All you do is you press here. The blade will pop right on out like that. So I've removed the carving blade. And now, of course, I come on in here with my bread blade, and you just pinch that together and you just push that straight on in like so. And then there's a safety here, so you're never going to activate this knife when you don't want to. You push that safety forward, and then away you go. Right, so if I wanted to go ahead and, um, and, and carve through my ciabatta, I can either cut through it straight like this. Oops, sorry, Matt, thank you. I got the wrong, the wrong blade there. I can either cut through it straight like this, right? Or, if I wanted to, I could cut through, um, because imagine if I wanted to do, um, uh, what am I trying to say, croutons. I can go straight through the bread like that. I can lift it up. This is one of those really airy ciabattas. So see what I can do? I can actually cut all the way down the length of this bread, right? So when you're making croutons, it just could not be simpler. You can see how simple and easy that is. I can even lift it up in this direction and go through it. So very, very simple, very, very easy. So for cutting bread, it's brilliant. For slicing um, cakes, it's wonderful. I mean, over here, we've got this brand new um, tool. I'll take the knife, thanks, Matt. This is my little um, loaf pan, right? So very, very easy to use. It's the first time we've ever sold it. So if you want to pick up on that, you better be fast. Then what you do, look at the gorgeous color you get, by the way, from that Durapan bakeware. So what I can do here, if I wanted to, watch how quickly, by the way, I can go on through and slice this cake. I mean, imagine how long this would take you with a regular knife. So it is great for so many things. And then if you wanted to do a beautiful little display, maybe you take a little bit like this and you just sort of layer these guys up. What do you reckon, Sarah? A beautiful, simple way to serve that gorgeous cake. And then everybody can kind of come, take a slice, help themselves. You've used that beautiful loaf pan. I'll show you how it looks from the side. 
And then, of course, a few candied pecan over that pumpkin um, cake. It's just a beautiful, simple, simple way to serve food for the holidays, but none better than when you're carving. Now, the perfect accompaniment, accompaniment for this, thanks, Matt, is, of course, my gravy separator, and I have it right here. I'm going to show this to you real quick. We showed this for two and a half minutes earlier. We sold about 1,500, right? This, my friends, will sell out before we get to the holidays. So if you want to pick it up, don't think I'll watch you next, next week and I'll get it then. Now's your chance. Here's what you do. You make your stock, right? So this is, this is happening, of course, after you've done um, that roast turkey. Then you go ahead and you take out all that stock. And you know the problem. The fat always rises to the top. Well, we've taken that problem and we've actually made it a solution because we've put a little strainer lid in the top here for you, right? So that just lifts off when you, when you want to take that out and clean it. But here's the cool part. I've actually gone ahead because you can see how the fat rises to the top of that. What I do is I press that button now and look at that. See how the stock, that jus, gets pulled from the bottom, right? The fat stays in the top, so we're going to go all the way down to when the fat is right there. We stop, and then, of course, we have the beautiful broth where we want it. We have the fat where we want it. We can go ahead and toss that um, out from the top. So I, I mentioned it. Two minutes, we sold nearly 2,000 of them. If you want it, grab it. Uh, there's a new hunter green color there as well. Look at this gorgeous roast beef. Now, here's the thing. I, I, we've cooked this roast beef rare, and have a look at how I can slice through it. Oh, yeah. Oh, that looks so delicious. I mean, who wants that chore of having to slice the turkey perfectly uh, and make everyone in the family happy? This is already very popular, the electric carving knife going fast, especially if you want that red. Uh, it's gonna be gone. Today's the day with five flex fan everything. And uh, get your gravy separator. And in the meantime, uh, jump online, place your order. We're gonna get right to the shrimp because this is not small shrimp. Actually, I'll go this way and show you the whole platter. This is not medium shrimp. This is not large shrimp. This is what they call colossal shrimp. And when you see how big these are, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. They're all beautifully hand-breaded, so they've got that beautiful, flavorful, crispy.